Awesome. Well, good morning, everyone. Hope you're doing well. If we have not already met, hi, my name is Lydia, and I'm all about empowering women to live from their purpose and to do so unapologetically. And this morning, I'm super pumped because I get to be joined by the amazing Tara Macklin. You can say hi. Hi. <laughs> And I say so that like you're my child. It's just go say hi. But anyway, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, Tara and I have got to know each other over the last few years. Has it been? I guess it's been a few months now, right? Mm-hmm. Of just yeah, of doing some various work and stuff together. And she is part of uh, Illuminate, which is a program that I've mentioned before. And I felt that it would be helpful to kind of bring context to what Illuminate is, um, the impact and outcome it's having for people. And so Tara was kind enough to join us this morning. So we're gonna dive on in because I know it is, time is precious in the morning for for us. (laughs) Yes. So so first question is, so how are things going before you started Illuminate? Well, um, for me, I've kind of been in the crossroads. Uh, we've had a lot of life transition and mm-hmm. it's really funny that the word pivot kind of fell on to me for the year of this year. It's like my word. And mm-hmm. so what Illuminate has really kind of done is helped me kind of refigure out what this pivot was like the things that I was working on before. I've just had this nudge to just let them go. Mm-hmm. And I'm kind of this, I want to say control freak, but Let's be real. It's probably what it is where I feel like I'm always know where I'm going. I've got things planned out. And this has been the kind of the first time in my life where I'm just kind of felt like I was flapping in the wind. And this has just really helped me kind of given me some direction and some guidance. And I'm absolutely thankful for it. So very cool. Yes. I love that. Okay. So then I guess that answers why you joined Illuminate in terms of what was going on previously with all the transitions. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pretty much. And like kind of getting into probably another question that's coming up like one of the reasons why I jumped into it also was because of you having worked with you in another program and just found that to be so beneficial to this mess of information I'd written down this paper and you given it so much clarity and you'd taken it from this space of like where I felt like I was venting to Oh no, there's like a story here. Like you're not just venting. So, um, I, you know, if you can do that for me and my ramblings and the things that, you know, putting the pieces together, I knew that this program was going to be amazing. So. Yay. I received that. Thank you. You are most welcome. Yeah. I think that's the, uh, that's the part that for so many, they don't realize that it's, they're in a bit of a cloud and you don't intend to be in a cloud. You're just in a cloud. Or for some of us, because of just the way that we process, there's constantly thoughts going. And so being able to kind of move outside of the the thoughts and to be able to figure out how to get all the pieces to line up is just so beneficial. So I'm so grateful. Yeah, it was just, it, it really, it does my heart very good. And I'm so excited when I see that happen for individuals where it's just, okay, it's clicking, it's making sense, and they're seeing it. So, yay. Awesome. All right. So what do you like about the program so far? Now, just kind of a preface, we're about, yeah, we're coming up to our third sessions. We're going to do our our third session check-in tomorrow um, as you're seeing this video. Um, So we are still, (laughs) we're still tilling ground. So, yeah. So what do you like about the program so far? Well, I can't say there isn't anything that I've not liked so far. Um, There's been great reflection questions that I feel like I've not seen really anywhere else in any other program that I've been in and stuff like that. Just things that have allowed me to kind of dive in in a different way and a little bit deeper of a way, especially since I'm in this kind of life transition period anyways. So um, that's been beneficial. And of course, your, your spark sessions have been amazing. I sat down and did, I had done the one hour one earlier before Illuminate had started and thought it was beneficial. So Mm -hmm. when all the modules came out, I had to go do the two hour one. And I was like, okay, yeah, I can see why this is two hours. Cause it definitely (laughs) does take like a lot more time to kind of sit there and, and write out all the things, but it's that 
has been a blessing in the fact that again, I'm able to take a pain point and instead of making it sound like I'm venting and just pouring out all these things, I can put it into what truly feels like a story to mm-hmm. where it could help somebody else instead of I'm wow 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 poor woe is me. No, mm-hmm. here's here's the things. Yeah. <laughs> here's what happened. Let's kind of maybe help guide you to where we can kind of shorten that time frame for you. So yeah, it's been quite nice. Super. Yay. I'm so glad you went back and checked out the two hour one because I remembering that we did the the one hour version. It's just okay, you guys. I mean, I'm glad that we were able to do this. I'm really, I'm such a slow cooker. I'm a slow yes. cooker gal. <laughs> it is because I know that these are, you know, anything that we're doing together, anything I'm creating, it's going to cause you to need to pause and think Yes. versus just rushing through. And so I'm so grateful that you're in this place of transition where you're going, I choose to not just simply get caught up in the moment, but to really pause and to see what's going on. So then that way I'm able to spend that time with my family and I'm able to better understand where it is that I can go forward with whatever it is that I'm creating and how I'm showing up for my family and for my business. So awesome stuff. Okay. So um, how has your outlook changed since participating in Illuminate? I feel like I have more opportunities in front of me. Um, I've definitely sat down and kind of worked through different pain points with the, with the spark in particular. Um, Mm -hmm. And just even some of the reflection questions have helped open up doors like, oh, well, this is a pain point for you too. Like, why didn't you think of this one before? So trying to work through some of those pain points to figure out what really is where not Excel, but just like this, this is the thing that I can really help people guide them through with whether it's my story or um coming up with some sort of like program or system so that way I can help serve others in a way that I've never been able to serve people before so Mm. something that just truly makes me feel like I'm alive I guess purpose would probably be the other word there like I feel like the things that I've done in the past have just been kind of my I'm, I'm educated in this. So I'm kind of, I'm excellent at it, but it's not that thing that just makes you get up and like pumped to show up every day. So that's kind of what this is really, it's made me feel like, okay, it's there. I just got to work through the things and find it. So, yeah, it's so good. (laughs) Yes. And oh my goodness. Okay. So I love that you said that in terms of the fact that you went to school for one particular thing which um, in your case was it's sports medicine, physical therapy, right? Mm -hmm. And so there's all of that knowledge and there's all of that expertise there and it's great. And it's a fact that it opened up and allowed for you to see different parts of yourself that are yes, connected to that area of learning and that area of study, but goes far beyond it. Um, And so, yeah, I mean, just, yeah. I'm sitting here going, I'm thinking back on all the awesome conversations we've had on this topic (laughs) and all of the individuals I know that you have and that you will be helping through your story to be able to just go, this is awesome what you're doing and there's more. I just, oh, I love that. (laughs) I just, I just get excited for my people. Awesome. So If someone, as they're watching this, is just going, okay, this sounds like it might be helpful. I'm kind of curious. Is there anything that you would give them in terms of advice? So if they're on the fence, what kind of advice would you give them? Well, um, honestly, I can't tell you that. Just jump in. (laughs) Um, And I guess I say that from having had the experience of doing a catalyst session with you. And Mm -hmm. so for me, it was just a no brainer. But if you haven't had that experience, like jump into some of the things that Lydia has offered out there through her videos or whatever, you're going to gleam something that's going to, you're going to get this little spark. And if you're getting that spark, this is, I'm telling you, this illuminates going to just stoke the fire guys. So just get in there and do it. If there, if there's anything that she's just lit a little spark for you, then just go in there and do the illuminate. Cause I promise you the the fire is just going to really just opens up a lot of doors. Um, 
I don't know that that really helps because it's very descriptive. <laughs> so that's just what my, my experience has been is that that catalyst session, having worked with you, um, just a little background for, for those of you guys that are watching. I jumped in on a book collaboration. One of my dreams was to be an author. And so that's another thing that I'm hoping to get out of this. I'm, you know, yeah. have this creative juice to write. And so I'm in another course that's helping me work on the writing and stuff like that. And Lydia is a part of that through these things that she calls catalyst sessions. So that's where we really got in and connected mm -hmm. and they're absolutely amazing. So <laughs> I don't know if there's a way for people to like access that or what you <laughs> have in those offerings out there, but yeah. that is that was kind of really what made me go, okay, this this woman has got it. So I've got to go be part of this thing. And, yeah. you know, I honestly will say that I did take a second to like, okay, Tara's too excited. I needed to pray about it a little bit <laughs> to make sure it wasn't just like jumping into something I wasn't going to use or whatever, but yeah. I just kept having the nudge, just, you need this, you need this, you need this. Yeah. So I went in and jumped in. So yay. I'm so glad. Yes. And so I'll make sure because we have mentioned it and Oh my goodness. Yeah. The book, the book course is phenomenal. That is by my dear friend, Megan Larson. So I'll make sure to post the link there. And it is possible to do a Catalyst Note session outside of that. So I've had a couple of folks who've connected and have done that but at the same time with authors you're already in that space of going, I'm looking for a story. And it's just, wouldn't you know, that's what I do <laughs> in terms of how I see life and how I help people with diving into their story. So yeah, so I'll make sure to post all the links so that whichever place you're at that connects for you. So there's Spark, there's Catalyst, there's Illuminate, there's book writing. If book writing is something you're going, oh, that might be something to do. So know that all of those are definitely available. So thank you so much, Tara, for this. I'm just, oh, thank you for sharing your heart. And it is, so the part that really lights me up is seeing that you're actually glowing <laughs> <laughs> and that as you're speaking, there's this exuberance and there's this life just, yeah, we're doing this. So we're going to keep going. We're only, like I said, at this point, we're only halfway through. So you can only imagine we're just going to, we're going to need to put on shades. <laughs> you're going to be so right. <laughs> <laughs> love it all right y'all so thank you again and we'll see you later bye guys